Hello guys, this is Buddha Chris, and today I'm going to be talking a little bit about the collection book. The collection book is just like a stamp book where you collect your heroes and traps and schematics, pistols, guns, everything, and you have a place to put them in the book, and you will be leveling it up. See, like right now I'm at level 12, and I'm doing this right now because at level 13 I'm going to get a legendary llama. I just got from this book too, I think it was level 9, uh, 500 V-Bucks, which mm, it's great. So I'm going to show you how you level up the book. You're going to choose these indicate you or tell you how many items you have in this category to put in the book. Like if I go here to the Islanders, we can put this one, but I don't want to use him yet. So I'm going to go to people and I'm going to be... Uh, selecting the ones I'm not gonna be using like this defender I'm not gonna be using that and this defender I'm not gonna be using it so here we go and just like that you level up you get your reward this is a legendary troll stash llama and yes we're going to be opening this right now let's go to the loot we have it right here and let's see if we get something hey, good. Titans uh this is going obviously to go hey, gold. profound revelation leave me be and here By we go ah uh, yes 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 quite rich as a pharaoh okay Not bad. One of these survivors. Yeah, that's bad. That's going straight to the book, in my opinion. Let's see this deep choice. Okay, we would have a legendary melee. Yeah, not gonna happen. I'll just go for the hero and hope for the best. Deep choice. Okay. This is gonna be a soldier. Yeah, I don't think I'll be going for a soldier. I'll be going for an outlander. Let's see what another deep choice. This is good. Uh, oh my god. This, this. Oh, this has to be like one of the worst decisions you gotta make because you got Grizzly Enforcer, which is the best. The best. Uh, Outlander with a Teddy, which I would love to have him, but this is Base Scout. Jess, which I'm thinking is the mythic. Is this the mythic? Let me do a quick search off camera on my phone because you know. And let's just go here and put face out Jess. And face scout Jess. Let's see. I really don't know if she is the actual legend. Uh, yeah, mythic. She's the mythic. What does she bring to the game? Let's see if I could get some. I will sure be adding like a picture or something in in the video, so you could see how she actually looks and everything. See this. this is the same one. Let me see if this gives me some info. I'm just looking for her abilities. Yeah, what I'm reading here, talking about her, is that she's like a farmer. Like, she's not good for missions. It's good to have her. Like, I don't even have her in my main account. But, yeah, this is, this is not good what I'm reading. And 
then again, I don't have Enforcer Grizzly as a legendary in my main account either. So. I can't really say I found something convincing. Let me see if I put here abilities. And yeah, I got nothing. Let me see here. She got a rework done. Okay, so it says she has Focus acquisition for the 6% chance on double loot. She has the loot llama, of course. She has a shock tower ability. She has face run increases movement speed of 25% for 4 seconds after face shift. She has phase out reduces face shift cooldown by 5 seconds. She has face shield. Face shift forces the shield to regenerate for 4 seconds. It has a longer description, but I don't want to read that. Keen eye lets Outlander see through objects. Face forward increases the teleportation range for two tiles. Upgrading the range of a useless ability won't save it. Sorry. Okay, yeah, that's true. Anti-material charge. That's the punch. Deep in the zone increases damage resistance. Increased by harvesting damage. Yeah, no. That's it. No, I don't forget an ability that it's seriously it. The damage this mythic about face shift just is how bad as a hero she is. Yeah, so I'm not going to sacrifice having a mythic just because it's a mythic and not having the Grizzly Enforcer, which is the best outlander with the teddy. So I'm really sorry face scout chess but i'm going to go with enforcer grizzly on this one because i'm mostly going to use him for everything from now on like if you saw i'm using right now the striker ac just because of the teddy so this is going to be great great help i'm going to show you a little bit of his abilities right here this is a chance to find double loot that every outlander has that hunter material charge the loot llama here's the teddy Increases the duration of Teddy by 5 seconds. Great. Increases maximal shield for defense. Great. Face shift. Great. Increases the range of the Teddy attack by 4 tiles. This is huge. Guys, face shift, face shield. That's something I was reading right now from the Jess. She has that. Barricade enemies damage by Teddy. Have the movement attack. And attack is slow by 30%. In the zone, yeah, everyone has it. Upgraded bear. Increases Teddy's rate of fire by 50%. That's great. Increases the damage of Teddy by 25% and duration by 5 seconds. This is great. Okay. I'm happy. I'm happy. We didn't, I don't know why we didn't get any candy from that, but that's okay. We'll be opening this in the next video. So, thank you for watching. Um, subscribe if you like the video, hit that like button, hit that notification bell so you, so you can get notified whenever I upload a new video. And as always, if you have any question, comments, or you just need help with anything, just let me know in the comments below this video. And I will see you in the next one.